Okay, we're back. Um, here's the experimental setup. It should look a little bit like the photo. You can see the two blinking proximity sensors, one on the breadboard and one at the top of the wine bottle. Um, it helps if you've drunk the wine bottle before starting. Um, uh, over here is the um, code. Over here is the output window. The program's already running. Um, and what I'm going to do, this is going to be very awkward, but I'm going to try to trace out a square in space in the kind of plane, in a, in a single plane above the breadboard with my left hand, meanwhile trying to hold this camera steady with my right hand. And this is not going to be easy. And so I'm going to keep one eye on my output window because, you know, the, the, the sort of range of kind of detectable area is actually kind of small. And so I'm going to try to move my hand right now um, to the kind of lower left corner. And I'm going to look, keep one eye on my output window to, to see if I've kind of got it right. Uh, how are we doing here? That's pretty good. I'm looking, for my experimental setup, for whatever reason, the minimum, uh, the sort of lower left origin is about 19,000 or so. So I'm waiting for both numbers to get down to that level. Okay, so here I am. I'm pretty good. I'm at iteration 525, and I'm about 19,000 on each axis. So I'm going to slowly trace out a square without moving. Oh, I already screwed it up. All right, try again. Okay, I'm going to, I'm at f iteration 500, and let's go for iteration 600. And here we go. 600, so I'm going to go up. I'm going to go right. I'm going to go down. And I'm going to go left. Um... That didn't work so hot. <laughs> I can tell by the numbers that that didn't work so hot. So I'm going to try one more time. Um, <laughs> this is science, people. Um, I'm going to try one more time at 700. Uh, iteration 700, I'm going up. I'm going right. I'm going down. And then I'm going to go left. That looked, the data looked pretty clean there, believe it or not. I'm at iteration 775. So I'm going to cut and paste that. I'm going to post that to the web page, and hopefully um, we will see.